badass in her own right, incredible actress Vanessa Kirby. Come on up, come on up. We have another incredible, there she is, there she is, there she is. Another incredible female badass, Aza Gonzalez. We have um, actor, musician, director, and the only man on the planet who can take these two MFs on, Idris Elba, ladies and gentlemen. And last but not least, I want to introduce these guys that have uh, their name on the poster and well deserve um, my my new brothers and um, two badass MFs. I don't. It's hard to know what to say about them except um, Hobbs and Shaw, ladies and gentlemen, James, <laughs> Jason Statham, and Dwayne Johnson. <laughs> Are you guys ready for Hobbs and Shaw? I don't know, you might not have heard me. I said, are you ready for Hobbs and Shaw? <laughs> guys, uh, you know, this energy is incredible. We wanted, we all wanted to make a movie that was big, that was fun. That also we wanted to make sure that we had the heart and the DNA of these Fast and Furious movies, which is the F word that we love to say, which is family. Um, wanted to make sure that we had the element of family and in heart, but also we wanted to make sure that we had our own identity and create something that was fun and that was unique and that was fresh and introduce these amazing new characters. Of course, first of all, take the chemistry that me and, uh, and this guy had, which I think plays very, very well in the movie. Um, and of course, introduce these new characters. Um, and so the idea with Idris, and I just want to say this because I want to embarrass him a little bit, is a, whoa, Idris, yes. The second sexiest man alive. Guys, listen. It's, I, I, he reminds me of People Magazine. It's like me too. Look, is that we wanted to, uh, we wanted to, we wanted to create the greatest villain that the Fast and Furious franchise had ever seen. Yes. Now, that I say that respectfully because coming from the franchise, myself and Jason, and of course Hiram and uh, and Chris Morgan. We've had some incredible bad guys. Of course, Charlize Theron, our dearest friend from Fast Day, she kicked ass, so it was a tall order, but there was one guy on this planet who could stand face to face with us, toe to toe, and really give us our lunch and kick our asses all over the movie, and it is Idris Elba, so brother, thank you so much. Yes, sir. And of course, um, one of the anchoring elements of our movie is culture. And I'm going to get to that in a second. And we wanted to create, yes, we wanted to create these female characters that, yes, in the Fast and Furious world, these female, I love you too, whoever that is. Uh, sounds like my mom. But, with a deeper voice. But uh, we wanted to create these female characters that, yes, they could hold their own like they do in these Fast and Furious movies, but that wasn't good enough. We wanted them to be proficient, be badass. You're looking at one of the most stealth women on the planet, and, and you will see her character when she brings it to life. Um, Isaac Gonzalez, thank you so, so much. Woo! Talking about you. <laughs> and, of course, we had to find we had to find, the alcohol is flowing tonight, I can tell. We had to find the right director, the right man with the right vision and somebody who can come on and not only execute great action, but also tell great stories and also create cool 
badass characters, like he's done in Deadpool, like he's done in his movies of the past. And uh, David Leach, thank you, brother, for delivering like you said you would. Wait till you see David's movie. Yes. Our movie. Our movie. Our movie. Um, three more people. I just want to shout out. I'm really going to embarrass her. I told her I would uh, when we text this afternoon. Is we wanted to find a woman who not who was proficient at what she did, and we wanted to create a bad, cool, a badass, cool character. Somebody who was a team member of MI6. And when Vanessa came on board, we knew that we had one of the greatest actors on, on the planet. So Vanessa, thank you so, so much for your talents. It's really true. She's so embarrassed right now. And one guy, I think you held him for me, right? Okay, so it's somebody who we are all very grateful for. And it's also somebody deeply personal, by the way. When I first started in this business years ago, almost 20 years ago, I said to him, I said, I don't even know if I have, do I have anything to offer Hollywood? He looked, he smiled, he said, you do, just keep on working and I believe in you. Ron Meyer, thank you so much for that. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, thank you. We are all here because of Uncle Ronnie. Um, and finally, Hobbs and Shaw, what you were gonna see when we were very yeah. excited, not only to showcase our, our our chemistry, but also showcase our cultures. And in Jason's and Idris's and Vanessa's culture, British culture, we showcase that. We also showcase one half of my cultures, I'm half black and half Samoan. And we showcase, yes, <laughs> Samoans are in the house tonight. We showcase this and it's, it's deeply personal to me and these guys know that too because it's the very first time that the culture of Samoa has ever been uh, showcased in a big global movie like this, so we're very excited. Now, the anchoring element of all these movies, Fast and Furious and our movie Hobbs and Shaw, is family. And the idea that um, I could bring on board and all these guys accepted this person with open arms with somebody who uh, not only represents our Fast and Furious mana, which is culture and overcoming and heart, but someone who in real life uh, represents that too. He's so inspiring and I thought if we were gonna showcase so I'm more culture, I want to go out and I want to get my own family, my own blood. And this guy, not only is he one of the biggest stars in the WWE, he'll go down to one of the biggest of all time. You know who I'm talking about. But also, uh, he is a survivor and a fighter of leukemia, and I'm so proud of him, ladies and gentlemen, Roman Reigns. Is our and, thank you, Huso. We're very proud of you. Very, very proud of you. By the way, he sent in his audition tape, and I was like, good, he doesn't suck. I told Jason that, so, so he's going to work out good. He's got a big future in Hollywood. So without any further ado, ladies and gentlemen, we're so happy that you're here uh, to share and celebrate this big night with us. Without any further ado, please enjoy the world premiere of Hobbs. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Hobbs and Shaw. Hobbs and Shaw. Enjoy Hobbs and Shaw.